If you got yourself a new iPhone, you might be wondering, is it possible to transfer WhatsApp data to it from Google Drive? After all, Google Drive app is available on both platforms, and you can find the backup files in the Google Drive app on your Android phone. However, they don't seem to reside anywhere in the iPhone app. That's because WhatsApp doesn't really allow WhatsApp transfer between platforms, just as it says on their FAQ. Fortunately, there are still ways to pull it off. In this video, I'll show you a simple and straightforward one. Let's get started. Step 1. Restore WhatsApp data from Google Drive to your Android phone. First, uninstall WhatsApp. Make sure not to keep any existing data. Then open Play Store and reinstall WhatsApp. Now open WhatsApp, verify your phone number, and then tap continue to allow WhatsApp access to your contacts, photos, and etc. When prompted, tap restore to restore your chats and media from Google Drive. Then set the backup frequency to never when you got here. Now you can see all your chats history, contacts, and images right here. Step 2. Backup WhatsApp to the local disk. To do this, head to Settings, Chats, Chat Backup, then backup your data to the local disk. Well done. Now you are ready to start the transfer. The tool we are using here is iCareFone for WhatsApp transfer. You'll find the link in the description below if you'd like to download. So once open it, go to the WhatsApp section. Next. Connect your Android phone to the computer. If prompted, enable USB debugging in the developer option. If you can't see the developer option, go to about phone, software information, then tap build number seven times to invoke it. Once recognized, plug your iPhone in. Trust this computer when prompted, and then make sure you have turned off find my iPhone. Once both devices are detected, go ahead and hit the transfer button. It's saying the WhatsApp data on your iPhone will be over it. There's no WhatsApp data on it yet, so we proceed. Here we can select an existing WhatsApp backup or create a new one to restore. As we just did it, let's continue. It's now on the stage of getting the data from the source phone. Okay, now we're going to verify the account. Type in the phone number used to sign in the WhatsApp then it verify. Make sure to turn off two-step verification for WhatsApp. Then it continue. WhatsApp will send a verification code to this number. Once received, enter it right here. And then hit verify to confirm. iCare phone will now generate data that can be restored to your new phone. WhatsApp will be signed out from the source phone. What we are doing now is sign in the WhatsApp on the iPhone. Once done, click on Log On to proceed. Now the restore process will begin. All your WhatsApp data, including chats, images, video, and documents will be moved over to your iPhone. The time taken hinges on how big the backup is, and your iPhone will restart. Well done. Now it says transfer successful. Let's check it out. So there it is. Now you have all the WhatsApp data on your iPhone. That's it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.